So today, we are gonna go to my favorite place in the whole freaking world. Guess where? The craft store. Oh my god, look at that really on my But yes, we are gonna go to Michael's craft store. I'm gonna show you guys all my favorite things that I love to get there. And I'm gonna show you the prices of them, how good of quality they are, and my experience with them. And I've been wanting to make this video for a long time, and I love you so much. So yeah, let's go to Michael's. I'm gonna give you guys a tour of basically what I do whenever I come to my favorite place in the world. When I first come here, I look at the fairy garden stuff because they're so cute. Look at all these little things. Mushrooms. No. Oh, look at the little dust lamp. Oh my god, that's so cute. It holds all your stuff. Why do I sound like a four-year-old every time I talk? I like to get this drawing book because it's meant for watercolors, which means the paper is like really super thick. Look how big that canvas is. Oh, it's a hundred bucks, man. So I like to get these canvases because it comes with like five of them, which is like a lot. And look, it's only fifteen dollars. Okay, listen. So whenever you go to Michaels. You can search Michael's coupon into Google and it'll come right up and then you get 15% off or whatever it is. And then they got these little tiny little baby cases. They're so cute. Right now they're buy one, get one free. Ooh. Holy Jesus. That means they're only $10 for five canvases. Yeah, that's really good. So like, especially if you're like, you're selling art and stuff like that, like, you know, you'll make more money that way. You know what I mean? Buy one, get one free. Yeah, that's, like, look, that's $10 and for get, five. And then if you get like two of them, you know, that, that can make you so much money. And you can get these little ones. These ones are basic acrylic paints, which are really good. But as you can see, they're $5 for one. But the reason... Ooh, these are pretty. Okay, so I'm going to give you guys a little tip. The reason, say you look at something like this, right? How much is this brush? $17.99. Yeah. And you're thinking, oh my gosh, I would never pay $17 for a freaking brush. But then you buy it and you try it, and you realize that it's the best brush you ever got in your whole life. So sometimes it's worth it because the quality of stuff it will be better. You know what I mean? Okay, buy two, get one free acrylic paint artist. Yeah, so like every time you go to Michael's, there's like really good deals that are going on. I like to get these little packs because these are really cute of like neon ones, and they're only $8. And then these ones are my favorite, the artist loft ones. These ones are only $4, but they work really, really super good. And, um... You need to get them in a large bottle. Yeah, or you can get it in a big, big-ass bottle. It'll last you a long time. <laughs> and these... <laughs> and look, this is a watercolor that I always get. Look, it's only $5. And look, and it even comes with a little brush. Isn't it cute? <laughs> this section, which is a bunch of wooden stuff, which is awesome. This is where I get all my boxes. See how cute? There's a bunch of different kinds of them. See how cute? And you can even paint a birdhouse. I'm gonna give you a tip. Listen up. If you want to get a box, always inspect it. So say I want this box. And it has a freaking slit right down the middle of it. The first one I picked up, you see? So you don't want that. So every time you get a box, just look in the inside and make sure it has no... Damn, that's a really bad one right there. See that? That's broken. Discount. That's broken. Right fun. <laughs> like this one, see? This one has a thing in it too. You don't want that. So always just make sure and expect them. Inspect them. Make sure they're good. Look, this one looks good. That's 
This one's like perfect. I gotta open and see the inside. And mm -hmm. look, we found a perfect one. <laughs> seen one like this before. I'm gonna get it. <laughs> Very cute. Isn't this cute? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, there's a bunch of wooden stuff that you can get, like you can paint on all stuff. Oh, and these things are really good. You go find magnets and you put the magnet on the back of it and you could paint it, make a little magnet. And then you wonder why things break here. Fail. <laughs> Look at this little block. That's so random. So these are little magnets. And I made mag magnets one time. And you can get these ones or these ones. And with the little wood things that I showed you guys before, you could just put those on the back of them. Okay, so now we're in the section that has the really cheap, like, little liquid paints like these. And there are so many different kinds of colors. Look how many. See, there's whites and blacks and neon paint. And then these ones are really good, the Craft Smarts. These ones are here. And they're really cheap too, only look, 70 cents. But look at all these colors they have. So these ones are good for, um, I like doing fluid art with them, which is like that really cool, like the melty kind of looking art. See, like $7, that's not bad. And you can get all these brushes and stuff. So this is the gold pen that I get all the time. It's so good. So this is the brand that I really like. And then they have this silver one, which works really good. So also, when I make my wooden stuff and my boxes and stuff, I use paint pens. They're only $7, as you can see. There's like thin ones you can get here, or you can get like thicker ones. But paint pens are kind of pricey. But the better ones, listen up, the better ones, walk the two other people. Sharpie paint pens. See, look, they're almost 20 bucks, but like, they, they'll last you so long too. I've had mine for literally a year. They you could use a so coupon and get 50%. And you can use your coupon. But like, look, they have like little like fine tip ones too. And paint pens, these are so good, I'm telling you. It like, I don't know, the more money that you spend on art stuff is like, I don't know, it'll just make your, your quality like better. Then we look at all the Jojo Siwa stuff because you know, like, she's a god, so, like how can you not? You know what I mean? Like a sticker book, like she's super sweet. Look at that thing. <laughs> so cute, look at this little croissant, you know? And now since we're in the kids stuff, we like to just play around and look at stuff. Look at the way Look, erasers. They're not even in packages. <laughs> and now we gotta look for the dinosaurs because we gotta go see how Oh, here they are. Oh, they're twins. Look, they're triplets. Oh. So now we just say hi to the dinosaurs. Do. And we cut them, we give them love. Do. And we say good luck in your new homes. Whoa, what is this? Why is that me in the morning? <laughs> like all three of my moods. When I make my dinosaur necklaces, I find them in like these little thingies. Like these, these little baby ones. Oh my god, look, it's like my little brother. So I was in one of these frames, so every time we come to um, Michael's, we always try to find it. So let's try to find it. There I am! Where? Right there! With Ooh. my fake mom! Wasn't I so cute? What happened to me? So anytime you go to Michael's, you just walk where the frames are, and you'll see me right there. Isn't that cute? Oh my god, it's the girl from the frame. Oh yeah, I know, that's me. <laughs> This is crazy. Now I gotta find a fake food. Where are you? I see. Look at this. Oh my god, I don't have carrots. You see how excited I get over this stuff? It's not okay. Look at the little shopping. 
Oh, aren't they cute? What's in that look one? It, you Is can that limes? Oh, they look like little cucumbers. They're limes. They're limes. Look, you can get a whole package of them. So They're so sweet. And then look, here are flower pots. You guys can paint flower pots. Look how tiny these ones are. Oh. And these ones are for the bottom of flower pots, but I make them and I use them as little ashtrays because they're cute and they look like little ashtrays, right? Look at this little baby ashtray. Hmm. This is cute. So this is called the clearance section and basically it's a bunch of stuff that's for like really cheap for sale. Look at these. They're little letters. But they got a bunch of cool stuff here you can find. Like little, little highlighters. Let's ask about that first. Just like random stuff. Look how cute it is. Look at the little... What's this called? Watermelon. Watermelon. Oh my god, look at the little croissants. And a little donut. No, that's a um, bagel. Bagel. Why do I want this? <laughs> that's really cute. Look at this neon. 3D chalk is on clearance. I love this stuff. You guys gotta experiment with that. It's awesome. Why don't I want to get one of her bows? Oh, I would get this one. Look at this. That's lit. Don't you love Jojo Siwa, Ma? So now we look at the glitter. Look how many there is. This glitter, I always put it on my face for like highlight. I don't know why, because I don't, I don't like makeup. So. Whoa, look at this one. Wow, that's a lot. It's assortment. Oh, Summer Mood Mash. Oof. Oof. Yeah, so I like I like using glitter. Glitter is fun. Especially when you do like acrylic paint and you're done with it and you want to let it dry. You just sprinkle some glitter on the ditch, you know? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Guys, this stuff is so good. You have to try it. It's literally ice cream, but it's freeze-dried. So it's like, it's hard ice cream. So now when I'm done um, painting my canvases and they're all ready to be shipped out pretty much, the only thing that has to be left is this stuff right here. Right? That's the one, right? So you shake it up a little bit and you spray it on your canvas and it makes it finish it and it's a little cute, you know? And then this stuff down here, you can use for your wooden stuff, your wooden stuff, like your frames and your boxes. And this is to protect it and finish it also. So that stuff's really good too. You always have to protect your art because it's art. So the only thing that I don't get at Michael's, which is really important, is obviously my Sharpies, my thick and thin Sharpies. But if you get them at Walmart, that's where to get them, because they're too expensive here. Thank you so much for watching my video. I hope that this helps you. Although that um, Michael's Craft Store is like the mother load of art supplies, there is a lot of other stores that you can get art supplies at for kind of cheaper. You can go to Walmart, Party City, there's Target, and Hobby Lobby. Sometimes dollar stores and dollar generals have um, cute art supplies too. On Wednesday, I'm going to Snowmass, Aspen, Colorado. I'm so excited. So I'm going to make some vlogs when I'm there and I go there every year to go snowboarding and I'm so excited. So I think my next video will be in like two weeks and I'll make a snowboarding video because I love you. Okay, goodbye. I love you. I love you.